Hello everyone, welcome. I am Teacher Sherwin. In this video, we are going to learn tips in writing the scope of our research project. A researcher doing his or her thesis or dissertation requires to articulate clearly in the manuscript the scope of his or research project. Let us first define what is a scope. Scope of the study refers to the parameters under which the study will be operating. Meaning, a researcher need to clearly articulate the domains of the projects and also in this section, he or she needs to state the factors that are within the accepted range of the research project. It also refers to the boundaries that a researcher set on the study and can be said to be within the researcher's control. Here is a tip in writing your scope of research. In developing your scope, you need to remember the five W's and one H. The five W's refers to first, why, second, what, third, where, fourth, when, and fifth, who, and the one H refers to the word, how. The first W is why. Why refers to the main purpose of the study. You need to reflect in your research paper, in the scope section, what is the general aim or objective of your research study. The second W is what. Your scope need to answer the subjects to be investigated and the theoretical constructs or the variables that will be included in the study. The third W is where. In our research project, we need to highlight in the scope section the research locale or the location of the study. It is necessary to articulate where is your study site. The fourth W is when. The scope section of your research paper should highlight the time frame. Meaning, you need to reflect the duration of the research project. Answer the question, how long will the study be conducted? The specific month or months as coverage for your data collection. The fifth W is who and the population from which there will be selected should be briefly reflected in this section. Who will be the respondents or participants of the research project? What about the how? The scope section of your research project should also highlight how the study or the research project will be conducted or accomplished. You may include the research design whether qualitative or quantitative and if quantitative is it experimental or non-experimental and if experimental is it quasi or true things like that. Here are the sample prompts to use in phrasing the scope of your research study. The study is to focus on the study aims to the study covers the remember that scope refers to the extent to which the research area will be explored in the study and specifies the parameters within which the study will be operating Remember to answer the questions in the scope section. What is the main objective? What are the variables or theoretical constructs to be explored? Where is the research locale? When will the study be conducted? Who are the target respondents and participants? And what method will be used to accomplish the research project? We need to be mindful when we define the scope of our research. Consider the feasibility of your work before you write down the scope. Or else, your research may fall in either of these three dangers. Fail before they start. Broad and dead. Or, 
Dead on arrival.